Shalom. Tonight, uh, Lord God Jesus Christ shall bless you with the prophetic vision for your ministry. The work shall be ordained by the Lord. The ministry work, the people, the anointed ones, your calling shall be ordained by the Lord and you shall receive the idea, the prophetic vision for the same. It is prophetic, it is being led by the Holy Spirit as per your calling according to the will of the Lord and you shall meet different people. It shall end up in perfect match and many shall be amazed. How is it possible, they will say. How did the Lord God do it, they will say. And it is all because you believed, you have the faith, you have been blessed with the faith. And so shall it be with all those people who are associated with you. They shall also receive faith for purpose, faith for calling, to support your ministry, to support godly cause. Marriages will take place, not one, not two, but many for the godly cause, for the ministry, for the work of the living God. It is all prophetic and when you see this prophetic vision, you shall be surprised. You shall be surprised to know that the prophetic vision which you will receive this month and even starting from tonight, it shall be the result of your long time prayers. It shall be result of your calling. It shall be result of the purpose you had been asking for, for salvation. Because you always prayed that the Lord God should make you the effective soul winner. You always wanted to win the souls and not only this but when you play the music according to your colleague when you sing the praise and worship many souls shall be saved even when you sing the songs playing guitar or drums when you sing the praise and worship songs many souls shall be saved it is the anointing it is the anointing for music anointing for praise and worship anointing in your presence as well even if you are in your office your presence will manifest in such a way that many souls shall be saved the ministry is for effective soul winning and the prophetic vision is that in groups you will save the souls and in groups they will be water baptized many people in one family many people in one household many people in one workplace many people in one location in one country in one city in one region many people of the same place of the same region and of the same type means they can be of the same color as well they can be of the same language speaking as well they can be of the same custom of dressing they can be of the same group not only this but they can have the same cuisine so you shall see most of the people coming from the muslims getting connected to you you shall preach jesus to them the holy spirit will touch them and only by the power of the holy ghost they shall be saved so it is the group of people there is a match because year after year according to your calling you had been having good friendship and good association with the Muslims. You had been sharing your love with them. You have received love from them. And now it's the time for the Lord. The Lord says that you had spent enough time understanding and being good friends with them. But now it's the same people where you had spent most of your time, most of your dedication, most of your money, most of your finances. Those same people will be water baptized and not only this, but it shall end up in the Lord's renewed glory. It shall end up all in the Lord's renewed glory because the Lord God wants to bless them. They are already the lost sheep of other pen. You are the lost sheep found. The Lord God has saved your soul. The Lord God has delivered you, anointed you so that you shall go and prophesy. You shall receive the prophetic vision. You shall pray for them. You will love them. Instead of hatred, you will love them so much that they will see the Christ within you. They will wonder about the love within you, the love of God, the love of Christ. And because of that, in the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost, they shall also be anointed because of the heart to heart connection. Now, as you are associated with this people, with the lost ship of other pen, you will have the heart to heart connection with them in such a way that they shall become your beloved ones and this is the prophetic vision of your ministry that now these people who are the lost sheep of other pen are now becoming your beloved ones in christ hallelujah 
It's easy to say, Lord, save my own bloodline. It's easy to say, Lord, give salvation to my own family, to my own brother, sister, to my own parents. It's easy to do these prayers. But the Lord has plan. The Lord has his people in Jeremiah 29 verse 11. And he shall show you his plan and purpose in this prophetic vision for your ministry. And you are called for this purpose. If you are called for this purpose, you are going to obey the Lord God Jesus Christ. You will pray for all those people who are of other pen. And they are actually the Lord's chosen ones. Not only you, but they also. Because the Lord God has chosen them. You are blessed to bless them. You are blessed to love them. And these people will come from other pen, from the Muslims, but they are your own people. You will love them like your own. And seeing your love, they will be amazed. They will be surprised about the one who is within you. The one who is within you is the anointing of my spiritual father. The anointing of my spiritual father from him to me and from me to you. Glory to Jesus. It's the right time according to my calling. There shall be many Muslims. They shall be saved because they will find love within you, the love of Christ within you, which they have not seen anywhere else. They are not getting converted. You are not forcing them. You are not preaching Jesus to them. You are only loving them truly. If they need anything, you will help them. They will find you as a strong support. You will become a blessing for many. They shall be in the household and you shall become a blessing for their household and they shall be amazed. They will love you for the love in you. They will love you. They will have relationship with you. And because of this, the Lord God will touch them because you are the blessed man of God. You are the blessed woman of God because your prayer shall be answered. You are heavily anointed and favored to bless them. Your prayers for them shall be answered. They will come from the other pen and they will be your people. Hallelujah. This is how the church is growing. This is how your ministry is growing. And I am showing you the prophetic vision. This is how it is growing. This is how it is becoming big. And they shall support you truly in seeking God, in supporting your ministry. They will encourage you. This is God's plan and purpose. This is the reason why love is the greatest of all. We love people of all the ages, of all the types, of all the languages, of all the color, of all the religions, of all the religions, no matter whether they are coming from Hindu background or Muslim background or any other Catholic Christians also. Because in my church, I water baptize people and I love people of all the religions. No matter, there are Obviously, there are people who say they are believers, they know Jesus, and they force me to love them. But it is not my calling to be in partiality. I don't have the partial love. The love within me is the Christ love, the impartial love. If you find love within me, the love is the Christ love. And so shall it be with you. For your calling, for your ministry, you will be loved and you will love many. And do not forget to shower your prophetic love in my ministry by sowing your seed because that's how you show that you love your mother grace. Hallelujah.